Hey everybody and welcome to this video. I'm Minx Laura123 and today I am very, very excited. A little bit hyper, you might say, because today is the grand opening of the new hobby craft here in South End on Sea. It's literally like 10 minute walk away from me, so I'm like, yes, hobby craft is going to be literally around the corner to me. I'm so excited, seriously. So yeah, I love hobby craft. Um, and when I first heard that they were going to have one in South End, I was like, really? really okay really and then you know you start walking past things are happening inside and i'm like okay this is really happening and now it's the day of the grand opening like it's actually real we have a hobby craft in south end yes <laughs> so yeah basically i love hobby craft i love all things like arts and crafts now i'll be honest with you i'm not very good at arts and craft okay but I still enjoy it. I still enjoy making things and colouring and painting and stuff. It's just fun. And I just love looking around hobby crafts. So the fact that we have one so close to me now, honestly, I'm really excited. <laughs> so, yeah, I am going to go to the grand opening. Um, so I'm trying to get there in like 10 minutes. I'm going to leave, get there. Apparently, the first hundred people in get a goodie bag. So, you know me, I'm going to like, da -da 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 -da, goodie bag. If I don't get it, I don't get it. But I'm going to damn well try to get there early. Um, but if not, it's all good. I'm going to look around the shop. I'm going to film for you. So it's going to be like you, yes, you, are coming shopping with me to Hobbycraft. Um, and if I get anything, which I'm <laughs> sure I will, I'll do a little haul when I get back. Now, it gets even more exciting. Oh, yes. Can it be more exciting? Yes, it can. Because being a cheeky minx Laura that I am, um, hence the name Minx, because Minx is cheeky. Anyway, um, I contacted Hobbycraft's head office. And I was like, hey, I'm a local YouTuber. I'd love to come and film on the day of your grand opening. You know, have I got permission? Because like, I didn't want to be walking around with my phone filming and then getting in trouble. And it's really, really awkward for everybody, including me, obviously. Um, so I was like, is it OK if I come and film? And uh, not only did they say yes, and they were very lovely, by the way, can I just say the staff at Hobbycraft who I've dealt with via email and stuff and on the phone have been so friendly, so lovely. Um, they not only said yes, I could film, but they've also, oh my God, you're not going to believe this. They've also said I can have £30, yes, you heard me correctly, 30 quid, £30 money to spend in their store. I mean, how nice is that? Seriously, I was like well shocked. I was like, oh. I'm just happy that you said I can film, like, let alone give me like, you know, a voucher that I can get some goodies. So, yeah, I have permission. I'm not going to get in trouble if I'm filming and I have £30 to spend. Now, I'm not going to be greedy with it. I'm not going to get all the stuff for me because um, Nathan likes some of their like figures and stuff you can make. Um, and we've looked on their website and they do do some. Uh, so I'm going to have a look, see what they've got, if there's anything for him. Um, I am looking for some things in particular in there. I'm looking for... Uh, my friend is moving house soon and I want to make like a, a good luck with your new house, you know, moving in kind of card. So I thought, well, this is great. I can just go in there and they've got card making stuff and that and stickers. And yeah, so I'm looking around for that. And to be honest, I'm just going to have a look around, see what else they do and if there's anything that takes me fancy. So I'm going to get ready to go now. But before I do, I just want to show you what I'm wearing. I've made an effort today. Instead of me going with my hair tied up and, a you know, old T-shirt and some leggings. No, no, no. It's a grand opening of hobby craft. Come on, let's, you know, let's dress up a little bit. So I've straightened my hair, as you can see. Um, ignore the part where I need to dye my hair because that's happening next week. But um, yeah, straight my hair. And also I have a dress on. Would you like to see? I will show you. <laughs> so yeah, this is a new dress, by the way. Do you like it? I was going to wear my denim dress, which is there behind, but I went for this one instead because it's pretty and pink and floral and stuff yeah obviously I have no shoes on I'm not going to walk around barefoot but um yeah do you like it I like it I think it's pretty cute I like the way it kind of falls off the shoulders as well these like big banky sleeves um anyway so yes all I've got to do put my shoes on and go oh and I also painted my nails blue anyway let's go to Hobbycraft South End <laughs> Okay, there are a lot of people here. <laughs> Let me show you the queue here. Oh my god. <laughs> and they are now officially open. Home of arts, crafts, making and baking. Well, I like arts and crafts. I like making things, but I just can't bake. 
Oh my days, I don't think I've ever seen this amount of people. Okay, people are going in now. Is that a dog going in? Yeah, there's a dog. She's holding a dog in her arms. <laughs> Even the dog's got in before us. <laughs> Okay, I'm walking in the queue. Look, it goes right all the way from there, right around there, and then here. Okay, so I've made it to this side of the queue now. So when I started, I was over there. <laughs> so we've gone all around, and now it's getting a little bit closer. There's a nice little breeze as well, so that's kind of helping. Oof. It's so hot today, and it's going to get hotter, so, you know, that's horrible. Uh, but at least there is a nice little breeze, so it's cooling me down a little bit. Look how close I am now. Okay, where do we start? You know what, I'm just going to go up every aisle and see what I can find. And also show you, the viewers, what is available here at Hobbycraft in South London Sea. Um, because you know you might want to come down here check it out for yourself have a look wow look at all these beautiful colors <laughs> by the way look what i got <laughs> i literally put <laughs> poor man he was like here's your gift card and i just grabbed it i was like oh sorry i didn't mean to grab it I'm excited. No, he's a really lovely man. Thank you if you're watching. Um, but yeah, I've got my gift cards. I'm going to keep that safe in my bag. I found my first purchase. Let me show you. It's these coloured pencils. And they're really good for the environment because they've been made from upcycled wood. So if you're a regular viewer, or even if you're not, you'll know that I love, or you might know, anyway, you know now, that I love doing like colouring because it's really like relaxing and stuff. So how cool is this? These beautiful colours as well. So they are going in the basket. I like the fact in here they've got the expensive stuff but you've also got like your basic stuff as well like your valley craft stuff so I think that's really good oh my god I love these paint by numbers I used to do these when I was a kid <gasps> love these they're so cute now what one should I get I'm gonna get one of them because as I say I loved these when I was a kid oh what one well, I think because I love trees so much and this is giving me kind of Bob Ross vibes, I'm going to go with this one. These are lovely little cases. Look at those. Very nice. Got all these different easels here. Choose your easel. these different colors so they're 50p they're 80p so wow look at these gorgeous colors they're so bright and they've got the bigger colors as well bigger colors and <laughs> bigger sheets as well sorry I'm, I'm surrounded by so much color look at all these boxes here big old storage boxes all your bits and pieces Oh, these are nice. Lots of different frames. Oh, wow. Look at this display of uh, all the wall here. Look at that. So we've got double knitting yarn. And I just love all this colour. Have I said that I like being surrounded by different colours? Possibly a few times. Uh, but I do I just think everything looks so lovely. I'm gonna touch this just oh it's so soft it's so soft oh wow look at all the sparkly stuff here I'm loving that sparkle sparkly oh look at this you know i would have loved it in here my grandma bless her she'd have been here sadly she died you know eight years ago but she uh she loved all stuff like this
Honestly, I'm trying to get in as much as I can, but there's just so much in this store. You're going to have to come and look for yourselves because there's just so much of everything. It's great. Oh, look at these. They're pretty. Pretty, pretty. I do Oh, wow. Wow, wow. Look at all this. <gasps> Fluffy. Oh, it's so fluffy. You can make a teddy bear out of that. Or that. Or that. But yeah, this is to me very teddy bear-ish. Oh, look at this beautiful purple and the green. Oh, I've got to dress that colour. Oh, this is cool. <laughs> like bubbly. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Look at this. This is gorgeous. Bit of animal print here. Yeah, my grandma, bless you, used to make all my little dresses and stuff when I was a kid. Hello there. Are you subscribed to Minx Laura's channel? If not, please subscribe. <laughs> oh my. Are you subscribed to Minx Laura's channel? If you're not, please do. I think what you should do is subscribe to Minx Laura's channel. I know I'm weird, right? Weird is good. Oh, these are cute. <laughs> a llama felting kit. Llamas. Mermaids. Oh, <laughs> look at the little sloths. Flamingo. <laughs> right, we're going to go in the next aisle now. I'm literally just walking up every single aisle. And I'm loving it. I mean, it is a bit busy, to be fair. I do suffer from social anxiety, so this is a bit of a challenge for me because there are a lot of people. But it's all good. I'm enjoying myself. I'm in the new South End Hobby Craft. That's all that matters. I'm not anxious. I promise. Lovely storage bags here. Loving the pattern on these. Look at that. I do like a nice floral. Oh, this is nice as well, a little bag. Now, being a bookworm, this sign would make me happy. It says books. And sure enough, here are the books. All you need to know about all these arts and crafts things. For example, you could get a book on 400 knitting stitches. Crochet toys. First time quilting. Aww. Sweet crochet, friends. Right, once again, just going to carry on down this aisle. Oh, they're cute. You can make little Christmas trees. Oh, look. <laughs> so cute. Love that. All different baskets here. And the reefs. Little <laughs> pots. <gasps> oh, it's floral foam. Perfect for the ASMR channel. Just get that, crunch it up. Oh, might have to get some of that. Or there's these little ones. What do you reckon? A big one or a little one? So price-wise, that's a fiver. Yeah, five pound or three fifty. No, I'll just go with the little one. I'll go with the little one. Oh, now I'm not sure. Do I get the green or the sandy colour? I have done ASMR videos with this stuff before but I've always used green so I think I'm gonna go with this like brownie sandy color instead and you go into the basket I love the cover of that book. The Master Guide to Drawing Anime. Amazing Girls. Mm. 
Right, we're going into the next aisle now. Oh, buttercream. I might have to get a pot of that. Me and Nathan love buttercream. <laughs> ah. And it's uh, Betty Crocker. Good brand. Let's put that in the uh, in the basket. It's been me and Nathan one night. Watching a TV show with a spoon each. It's not good for the diet, but it's fun. All right. Now that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> love it. Wacky string. I used to love that as a kid. But my mum would always moan, it's gone all over the carpet. <laughs> I'd be like, you just pick it up, it'll be fine. There is just so much stuff <laughs> everywhere. It's just, just so much to look at. Ah, uh, buttons. I think it's because, as I say, my grandma was a dressmaker and she had all her little tins with different bits and pieces in that I loved buttons when I was a kid. And even as an adult, I love looking at different buttons. Some of these are super cute. Look at the little lips. <laughs> love that. Oh wow, so these are iron-on ones, okay. Ooh, maybe I should get one for my um, my jacket. But what one? Oh, I like the, the hands, but the lips are cool. I like that tattoo one as well, actually. So much choice, I can't choose. Oh wow, no, I found it. I found the one, I think. I think, I've, oh no, but I like that one as well. Right, I'm gonna go with this one because it's super cute and it's pink and sparkly, so I'm gonna go with that one. See, I'm not gonna do it now because there's way too many people, but another time when it's quieter, I could come in here and get some material for backdrops because like stuff like this, is, I mean, I've got that one with the skulls on and I just hang it behind me when I film and uh, you know, you get a little backdrop out of it, but yeah, it's way too busy now. <laughs> but once they've kind of been open a few days and stuff, I'll try that. The queue to pay for stuff is massive. Uh, all these people are queuing. <laughs> but it, it's like that because, you know, it's the first day, it's just opened. You know, oh wow, it's pretty cool. Um, you know. I mean, it's a good sign that people are here shopping, so, you know. It's in here. Yeah, you could have had that, you know, fluffy stuff and the filling. Got your own uh, teddy bear. Well, I assume that's where they come and cut the material when you want it. sneaking a look in here don't know if they're gonna be doing classes in this back room or something I don't know I'm just being nosy but maybe
also, I want to make, as I say, my friend uh, and good luck in your new house card. So, I'm thinking, like, maybe some thing like this. I don't know, like little stick-on decorations. That'd be quite funny and cute. Oh wow, look at this. I like the way they've put the, the light underneath so it really shines and all the colour. Really pretty. Oh, that's lovely. Look at that. I've just seen this, how cool. Sweet memories, 1980s. Oh my, Let's see what ones I remember. Oh, opal fruits. I still love a ripple even now. Um, smart ears, crunchy, roses, Kit Kat. Oh, of course, it used to be called Marathon. It's now, um, what's it now, Snickers. <laughs> now, this is the bit that Nathan wanted me to look at. Um, if you're new here, by the way, Nathan is my fiance, and he said, you know, he's after something um, that he can make, the well, that we can make together. You know, be all coupley. <laughs> um, so I've already made a little boat ages and ages ago that sits on my bookcase. Oh, wow, they've got the, um, what's it called? Hold on. Oh, this is so beautiful. I've seen this ages ago. Look at that. But I did say I'd get something for Nathan and not me. I mean, to be fair, I have a big old basket filled with stuff there. <gasps> Titanic. One of my favourite films, as sad as it is, because, you you know, you know the ending. But it's still a beautiful film. Um, so yeah, you got all the bits and pieces and stuff. What else have we got? A Thunderbolt. Star Wars. There's the gorgeous William Shatner when he was younger. Hey, William. So, like the big Titanic, this is the, uh, the smaller version. This is pretty cool, isn't it? That one is cool. Where was it? Where's it gone? Over there, but it's massive. But this one we could find place for on one of our shelves that's a bit smaller. You get all the bits and pieces in there that you need. See, Nathan's gonna love all the paints in here because he does all his Warhammer painting. So they've got all these cool paints and stuff. Yeah, please. Oh, now I've picked up the Titanic. I'm like, would Nathan prefer one of these instead? I know he likes all his tanks and stuff. Like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> oh wow, I love the packaging of these, like little retro television boxes. So cool, I love that. Thunderbirds of gold. I really love those boxes. Oh wow, sun catchers. I love these. Because it's a sun catcher. Oh, I was just going to say, oh, it looks really nice, you know. When the sun hits it, oh, anyway. Oh wow. What one should I get? I think I'm going to get the alien because me and Nathan are into our UFOs and stuff, so that'd be pretty cool. Oh, but look, there's a little mermaid as well. She's super cute. I'll get that one as well. <laughs> right, I'm about to put on a show for you. If I can figure out how it goes. There we go. There we go. Okay, we got it. We got it. Oh, I love it. <laughs> <laughs> so, no one's looking. 
that's the end of the show. I love these. Hand puppets. Let's choose another one. Uh, who wants to play? There we go, you can play. Oh, where'd you oh? What's <laughs> like huh? Hello there. <laughs> Don't give up my day job, right? Hello there. We are at the we are at the new hobby craft in South End. Okay, that's that. All right. Okay, I'm gonna walk away. <laughs> walk away. Yeah, this sort of stuff. Nathan is gonna love for his uh, Warhammer, the scenery and stuff. Really, really cool. Googly eyes. Do you know what? <laughs> this is really random, but I saw um, an ASMR video the other day. I can't remember who it was, but she had all googly eyes over her hands, like stuck on, and I was like, how cool is that? And it just made me think of that. I would do that video, but then it's gonna like I'm copying, which I would be, so I'll leave it. But googly eyes. Loving all the colouring books, really nice designs there. Oh, look at that one. Whimsical Girls, really, really nice. All the different craft magazines here. I like the little ice creams going along there. Yeah. It says magic bubbles that you can catch and hold. Two pound. I want a magic bubble. I want to catch it. Do you know what? Let's do it. Let's try some magic bubbles. Uh, we'll go with a pink. Oh my god it's halloween stuff yes i am um, <laughs> i love halloween there we go oh my god cute halloween stickers <gasps> oh my god i can't wait for halloween is it october yet not yet okay looks like me <laughs> stickers oh my god these are amazing oh wow look at that I'm gonna get these foil stickers and you know what I do with foil stickers I put them on uh, well I put them in various places but um, one place in particular I do put them is on my bookcases like on the outsides because it just looks really nice kind of brightens up my bookcases oh and I need some card uh, uh, my friend's well card <laughs> what's this one here well that's nice it's pretty sparkly yeah I'm thinking I could just I don't know, fold it up like that like a little card and it doesn't really maybe it's not the best hold on no it doesn't actually stand up it's quite sort of floppy uh, they did have some card in that first aisle I think like as in like firmer, harder cards, so I'll probably um, go back to that aisle and get some of that. Oh, that's what we needed. We needed some of this. We've got some pictures to um, put up in our room, and yeah, awesome, that'll be perfect. Oh, see more Halloween stuff. I am happy. I see Halloween stuff. Witch's brew, I'll have some of that. <laughs> I've got to hand it to you. <laughs> mm. It's very odd, but I kind of like it. It's a papa, papa, paper mache hand. I'm thinking I could use these in an ASMR video. 
By the way, if you haven't already checked out my ASMR channel, please do. Minx Laura 123 ASMR. Um, yeah, these could these could be something. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe like a hand massage. Hmm. I don't know, they're a bit creepy. <laughs> they're creeping me out. I'm loving this. LED neon light and it's a bat. Love that. That look really cool at Halloween on our little decoration on the table. We always decorate the house for Halloween. Yeah, I'm going to get that. Wow, there's just so much Halloween stuff. I'm loving it. Oh, wow, look at this. Extra large plush pumpkin. Ooh, I like the greeny colour. Oh, and the purple as well. Oh, they're really soft, soft material. Loving that. Oh my, so much Halloween goodness. Little mini lights there. <laughs> Fright tape. I'm loving this little candelabra. Very nice. And we've got the uh, the pumpkin piñata. <laughs> really cool. Do you think I'm too big for a fairy house? <laughs> I'd love to sit in that. Like a little cardboard fairy house. I mean, I'm only four foot eleven. I might get in there. Oh, look, I could sit in a little train. Right, I'm back here again. Whew, I've been in here ages. <laughs> I love it. Right, I'm just coming back here. Where was it? I oh, was that way. To get the um, card. Oh, here we go. Look, 50p for some coloured card. Um, even though I love that blue one that was sparkly, it was just like more soft. So I think I needed something a bit harder that could actually stand up. I'm going to go with purple because it's her favourite colour. So there we go. Make a little card out of that. Put the stickers on and stuff. I mean, to be fair, I could just, you know go to a card shop and get her a moving in card but I think she'd appreciate the more personal touch <laughs> okay right so I'm gonna go and queue up now and pay for all the goodies for right, I don't know where the queue starts I don't know where it ends where are we going I'm thinking I've got to walk round here. I think I'm just... Is this the end of the queue? It is. Okay, yes, this is the end of the queue. Uh, I think. I hope. I'm just going to stand here. Okay, so I'm just walking home now. I have to tie my hair up because it's so hot. Oh, my God. Um, oh, my God, it was brilliant in there. Look at all this. Look at all this. I'm going to do a haul when I get in. A quick little haul just to show you the goodies that I did get. I've got a few more bits as well. <laughs> when you're like standing around in the queue. I'm like, oh, look at that, look at that. Anyway, ended up with a few more bits. So yeah, carry on watching for the haul. And uh, I'm going to be doing an ASMR video with the stuff that I got as well. Like um, an ASMR hobby craft haul or something. So if you're into your ASMR, look out for that video as well gonna film that today at some point but yeah it was brilliant really loved it in there lovely friendly staff lovely lovely shop and so much stuff in there I think I missed a bit as well when I got to the till I was like oh did I go in that aisle I don't know so <laughs> so much to see it's great anyway I'll see you when I get home okay so I'm at home now and I'm gonna do a hobby craft haul for you Right, there's a lot of stuff here, so I'm going to try and get through everything as quick as I can. So first of all, I have these two paint by number sets. They're both equally lovely. So this one gives me kind of Bob Ross vibe, you know, with the mountains and the happy little trees. So yeah, love that one. And this one is this beautiful quaint cottage. I could just imagine myself there, just sitting there having a cup of tea, 
reading my book, then going for a walk outside, lovely. <laughs> so you get your brush, you get your different paints that you use. Um, so yeah, really looking forward to do this. I love like painting and coloring because it's just very calming, it's very relaxing and it's, it's fun, you know. Um, next up, Nathan was very happy when I showed him this. I said to him, right, visualize this, me, you, a couple of spoons, and some of this and he was like oh yeah <laughs> so yeah this is the Betty Crocker vanilla buttercream icing oh my god this stuff it is fattening let's be honest but it's so good so tasty um then I've got this uh I can't remember what it's called foamy stuff so I can use it in ASMR videos people find it very what is it oddly satisfying and relaxing and that kind of crunchy sound that it makes when you cut it and press it and stuff so yeah got that got this really cute little money box here and this is a paint your own money box in the shape of a wishing well um, and ever since I was a little girl I've been obsessed and loved wishing wells we've actually got like a medium sized wishing well um, in our garden so yeah I think this can join it we'll have two out there so super cute right that's that um, Oh yeah, I've got these colouring pencils here. These are great for the environment because they've been made from upcycled wood, which is brilliant. I love the packaging, the really, really nice packaging on here. Look, it's so cute. And the pencils look good quality. They look nice colouring. They just, yeah, really happy with those. And as I say, good for the environment, which is good. Now, I showed Nathan the kit that I got him. So this is the RMS Titanic kit. So you get the paint, the glue, and obviously the model and the brush and stuff. And he was really happy. I was like, look, I hope you're gonna like this one. And then I showed it to him. Um, and also I told him that there were so many other kits there with tanks and different things. So he said in the week, he's gonna come and have a look with me to see if there's other kits and stuff that he wants. And I also told him how many like different paints and sprays there were um, and like scenery that he could use with his Warhammer stuff. So it's all good. Um, so yeah, this is from Revel, which is a, you know, a good brand. And I'm very happy with this. Gonna go in our bedroom once it's all um, done. Then I picked up these uh, little gems here. How many did you get? Oh, 56. So I think these are so lovely, really, really nice. And the plan for these, some of them I'm going to put on uh, my friend's card, but the others I'm going to use for my nails. So they can be like little gems on my nails. I thought it was quite a good idea. Um, what else have we got? Oh, my foil stickers. I love my foil stickers. These are so me. <laughs> they seriously are me and um, I'm going to put these on my bookcase because I love putting stickers like, at the front of my bookcase so love those um, as you know I'm obsessed with Halloween I got a little bit excited in there so I've got the LED neon light bat so when it comes to Halloween he can sit on our um, table with all our other Halloween decorations so that would be pretty cool love that purple colour that's going to look awesome um, also got my skull kind of mason jar glassy thing how cool is this now as you can see in the video they did have other colors but i really like this one the best because it was purple and i just i'm not going to wait till october to use this i'm going to use this later because it's so hot and there's flies everywhere and they're going to drink so this way having the lid on the top it stops that so that's cool and it's just really cute <laughs> um and also i've got this uh, bag here so i think this is for kids when they go trick-and-treating but but I'm going to use this as a book bag in the month of October. Uh, so when I've got the library and stuff or, you know, book shopping, I can take my little skeleton book bag with me. So it's all good. Um, okay, more Halloween stuff here. Got some stickers. These are really cool stickers. My favourite one, where it is, is the Bat Candelabra. I just love that. Um, you've got a, a cauldron there, an owl, the witch doing a little dance, <laughs> the pumpkins. Oh, it's so cool. Yeah, I love these. Well, I also got these, oh, dropped them. Two uh, sun catchers. Sorry, I'm trying to pick this up. <laughs> so professional. Two sun catchers. I've got this one here, which is this lovely little mermaid. And I've got this alien sitting in his spaceship because me and Nathan are really into our UFOs. Um, I've got this iron on patch for my denim jacket. There were so many I could have chose, seriously, I loved loads of them. But I went with the lips one because, I don't know, I just really like the colouring and the sparkly look. And I think it would just look good on my jacket, like it would suit uh, the denim colour. And also I've got other like badges and things on there. So nice kind of size for my jacket. Um, I'm a big kid because I've got myself some magic bubbles that you can catch and hold apparently. How many bubbles can you catch? So this is going to be really good fun. Um, I know I'm a big kid. There we go. 
Um, oh, got some of this adhesive tack, which is like pretty much like blue tack. So I can use it because we've got some pictures to put up. So I needed blue tack, so I was happy when I saw that I had that. Um, and also, I've got these lovely uh, toppers, like stickers that I can put on. Uh, well, I can stick them on my friend's card because she loves plants and stuff and butterflies. So there's a butterfly there and flowers and plants. So yeah, and obviously I've got the purple card that I can make the actual you know, moving in card with. Oof, so there we go. That is my Hobbycraft haul. I really enjoyed it. I thought it was absolutely brilliant. I love the store. It was so great to see so many people all buzzing, all excited. You know, everyone's friendly. The staff are really nice. Everyone was nice. I couldn't fault it. It was lovely. Um, so I'll definitely be going back there again and again and again and again and again. <laughs> so yeah, it's really cool. Really enjoyed myself there. I was there for like an hour or so because like I'd, obviously I was filming. Um, but to be fair, I was just enjoying just taking everything in and, and there still was more that I probably missed. So yeah, I'm definitely going back. <laughs> anyway, hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget, click like, comment, share, subscribe. Check out Minx Law 123 ASMR, my other channel. Links down below. All my social media links down below as well. So come and follow me on there. And if you do want to spoil me or treat me, I have a throne wish list. Links down below to that as well. Uh, let me know in the comment section which item you like the best and let me know if you're into arts and crafts as well what kind um, have you ever been to a hobby craft and honestly if you're in Essex seriously go to the south end and see hobby craft it's lovely in there you're gonna love it all right everyone thank you for watching take care bye